we said there Andrew. from the Bees Knees. Um, we're back. It's been a while. We've been so busy. We've barely had time to get on here. Yeah. Yep. We've been preparing the shop for Christmas. More stuff keeps arriving. We keep putting it out. It's, uh, and then the day goes and like, oh, we missed the chance to do another live, but we're here. And you'll be pleased to know we have got ourselves in the spirit. We are seeing Christmas cows as we work. <laughs> it's not right, Oh, is it? no. Watch out. Trish is going to go for it with these new tins. I might do. So, Ella Bridgewater, brand new tins for the holidays that everybody normally loves. We have the partridge in a pear tree, which um, from the last couple of years in the deep rectangular and the um, the tea caddy. And then we have, go for it Trish. Three French, French hens, hens two, two turtle, turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Look at the whole set. So the, the three French hens and the dome lid caddy um, with the two turtle doves are brand new this year um so they are fabulous we've restocked the um christmas toast um string tin which has ribbon in mm -hmm. and then the winter animals tin such a popular one from past years is back also with the winter animals pocket tins well these are the winter scene pocket tins these ones and these are the winter animals so these are little tins just for putting little goodies in you could put money in if you're giving somebody money as a gift or Put jewelry, 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 diamond ring, <laughs> gold bracelet. <laughs> Are you watching? <laughs> um, so they're just great for gift giving or, te you know, party favours. You could put them on your table with a little gift in. Just fabulous. And then, of course, the tin baubles that are just best sellers every year. So we have the winter scene ones from the last couple of years, but brand new this year are what they call in the Christmas celebrations one. So this is the Hawthorne Berry. There's Ho Ho Ho, Christmas Celebration, and the Christmas... Take it off. I'm gonna to have to take it off. Our oh, cute little tree here. And then the Christmas pudding one. They've got like, they're kind of goldy. They've got a sheen to them, haven't they? So yeah. they look quite special, don't they? And as usual, they you demonstrate how your nails my, are. My new nail, manicured nails. Um, they open up, again, to stash in jewelry, sweets, money. Yeah. <laughs> and these patterns are matching like the putting one in the celebration matching um, the uh, pottery they've got. This yeah, year this well. year's pottery yeah. collections. Mm -hmm. And then of course, remember Bridgewater on the decoration front, there are also the beautiful um, ceramic ones, the pottery ones, the mini jug, the mini teacup, and the mini mugs. So they're really special additions, great gifts. I think if you know you like to buy, some people collect decorations like that, like to, to give them as gifts. So. Mm -hmm. That's all new on the Umbridge waterfront and the, the winter house tin. So just make your wrapping a little different with some of these tins this year. Well, the tin itself is a nice gift because that's like tea caddy size. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Forty tea bags in there, quite nicely. So. Um, yeah. 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 I would use it. And the little gingerbread and the mini gingerbread. Yeah. And um, so another one of our new new uh, favourite tin uh, designers is Sarah Miller. Got to get it right. Um, so we're getting for the first time her Christmas tins and they have a lovely matte finish. Look at the robins there lined in, lining up and the, the gold in them as well. So with the matte finish with the gold actually gives it that really yeah. special They're really, touch. really beautiful tins. There. So that was one of the deep rectangles that you can certainly fit cookies in and things if you're gifting. Christmas trees and actually it's one of your favourites, isn't it? Yes, I, I love the Christmas them. tree and with the gold and all you... Around the side, there's little gold stars that sort of sparkle on the side there. And then there's two pheasants and um, the penguins. Penguins. So no, that's, the, gold, that's what they call the small rectangle tin. Then there's a whole collection of the pocket tins too, which um, these are... Going on. Sorry. <laughs> Fit um, a gift card in there for sure. Yeah. And they're just really nice keepsake tins with the... A key to a new Mercedes Benz, perhaps. <laughs> Mark, he is watching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so and then the long ago, so they've got. She's also got these beautiful bowl baubles again with the matte finish and the gold. There's the leaping stack. Deer, prancing, the reindeer, prancing, prancing reindeer. reindeer. It's called. As I was going to say, it was a stag. And then the deer. That could be the stag yeah. in the woods. You can see it with the, some the leaves at holly. the top. They're lovely. Holly. We're really pleased um, with them. Yeah, I actually really like these. And uh, pheasant, which is like a nice, beautiful green. She always uses such nice jewel colours on yeah. her tins. Very rich jewel tones, which, look at that, there's a few little bunnies. Didn't even know. Yeah, little bunnies. Yeah. 
Thank you. And there, I've got them on the tree here, along with some of the ones we've had in previous years, like the, the classic Thornback and Pill, Robin and Holly. Um, and we've got some of the Victoria Eggs bone china ones that are just for Christmas. There's Santa on his Santa's sleigh. Santa's sleigh, yeah. We still have some Jubilee yes. ones left, I yes. think. Which do we both Yeah, we do. Mm -hmm. We do. And yeah. then some Christmas Eve, like, nostalgic baubles with a very sort of oldie worldy sort of design on mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. All very nice. And those, you click them out and you put your candy in there, money, gift. You know. Yeah, lottery tickets, somebody said. Um, One time you could oh, show yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. probably I missed the it. billion dollars last week. But, yeah. And there's more in the Thornback and Peel ranges. As you, we've got the rabbit and pudding and the uh, Robin and Holly, so you can check those out under Thornback and Peel. And also check out on those. We've got the linens that match. Yes. Yeah. And we have linens on this year's Emma Bridgewater Christmas biscuits. Biscuits, which still need to be added. Add them, add them. <laughs> we'll <do> that. <laughs> um, and we've got... <clears throat> Oh God, we've had lots of new chocolates, goodies, biscuits come in, so check those out under seasonal. And then it's actually under brown is the holiday treats, but you can see everything in there. And just um, Advent is getting close, so lots of people have been buying Advent stuff. But we've got this is Cadbury's new Advent bar. Now, I'm more of a chip, crisp, salty person. Trish is a chocolate person. Could she do one it's, block a day? It's a challenge. It is the one. Oh, it says it on there, one day one challenge. One day challenge. Could you eat only one little square? So you open it up and it looks like a Christmas tree and it's their numbered chunks. I don't think she can One do it. One a day. It. Well, it's the same as getting a chocolate apple candle with windows. You can cheat with those as well. But this True. is so much easier. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a fun, a fun new Advent item this yeah. year. So we have got some Advent things left. The beautiful Emma Bridgewater Advent calendar keepsake. Um, some calendars and candles left. And you've still got time to get the chip. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah. All right. Well, I hope you love the new tins and um, we will see you soon. All right. Thanks.